What's going on y'all, JT here with a quick comparisons and test between the Traxxas Max and the also Traxxas Haas. Now you guys know the Haas is the new kid on the block for Traxxas and the Max been around for, what, about a year and a half or so. <clears throat> now to my Max, um, this is updated or upgraded with the wide arm so you guys can kind of see the differences in the width in those and also the size in the two cars as well but I kind of did want to get these two out and test them now they're both running on 4S the Haas has a upgraded speed control and that's it that's all I did to it. it still has the stock gearing and everything else on it and the Max has of course the wide kit added to it um, but they both have stock gearing and stuff so they're both kind of modified the max isn't going to be stock out the box so it's probably going to handle it was well, not probably it is going to handle better than it would um if you just ran it completely uh stock out the box stuff but we're going to go ahead and we're going to get these run out of max has been around for a while I've run the heck out of it you guys can see that there so this is uh not the best comparisons but i did want to get these two out and kind of run them at the same time so let's go ahead let's get these set up for some speed runs real quick all right, y'all, first up is going to be the Max. I said I got brand new Z batteries in. I know you guys been wanting me to kind of get those and give those a test. And you guys can see the GPS is picking up. That's at four miles per hour. I believe we were getting, we got in the lower 50s with it. So hopefully I can get out to full speed out here. Stay away from this guy with this car in case my pinion gear comes loose or something. <laughs> we definitely don't want that to happen. That's full speed. Oh, 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 oh. Definitely don't want to hit nothing. Take it down one more time. So I probably can't get up to 100% full speed, but we're going to try one more time. Gradually build up to this. So, Whew. That sucker is willing. All right, let's see what kind of speeds we have pulled off with that real quick. Oh, that four. Oh, no, we can do better than that. Hopefully it's uh, picking up. I don't know if it's picking up completely, but sometimes the GPS and stuff stuff does act crazy. This ladies come by here too, so. Wow, wow. <laughs> so we probably can't get up to full speed out here, but with this area, <laughs> this is what we're getting. Uh, almost 50. Uh, I'm going to run it one more time. Let me go over here. <laughs> and uh, bring this thing on back down. Hopefully no cars will come around. I can keep my driving ability up some. I think we can get full speed going this way. TSM is kicking in in full effect, y'all. Let's see if we beat that 50. <laughs> now nah, still 50 point. 50 miles per hour, 50.1. Um, go down a little bit further, make sure no cars are coming, make sure we're safe. And we'll bring this on back down because I am way down there. And let's get them going. Hopefully I won't hit as we call those islands. Full speed. As far as I can get out here. <laughs> right, let's see what we got. Ah, still 50 point, 50 miles per hour. So I know what to do about, uh, I think it did about 53 or 54, I don't know. But that's as far as I can get out here with this. This area is kind of crazy. But anyway, let's go ahead and let's get the uh, the Haas hooked up and let's go ahead and see what that can do. All right, y'all, we got the Haas hooked up. Now this is gonna be very interesting. I got this on the front of the Haas. It's zeroed out, uh, it is catching. Um, I know that I probably can't get this up to full speed the way this thing is gonna be willing. And that's why I put it on the front of it to kind of weigh it down a little bit, but hopefully we can, uh, Gradually build up to the speed and get it out there. You can almost get it there. So this isn't the best area for a speed test at all, but I wasn't trying to go to several areas just to do this test. I'd rather just kind of do it all in one area. But the horse is handling pretty good actually. 4S LiPo. You know what, let's see what we got real quick before we go to this other part. Uh-oh, I see some 40s on here. 45.6, uh-oh, uh-oh. I need to play some uh some drama music. Dun -dun -dun, dun -dun, something, I don't know. All right, we're gonna just do one pass. See some cars coming through here and they're starting to get packed over there. So uh, 
We'll see what the Haas can do here. Woo, don't want to hit that curve going full speed. I would go up top, but see, that's coming down at a hill, so it's going to give an unfair reading for it. So, uh-oh, 49.7. Uh-oh, let's see this. Now, you guys, take in mind with my Max, it has not been cleaned or anything since I first got over a year and a half ago. So, this horse is practically new. It's only been ran. Well, it's been run a lot, but... Woo, TSM is kicking in in full effect, and don't hit that JT with your GPS on the front of it. <laughs> All right, let's see if we at least got 50 with this. 49.7, so... Uh... <laughs> Three tenths of a mile slower, I think that's pretty good. They're probably both gonna do in the very low 50s with it if I had a smoother area. But anyway, let's go ahead and let's set this up and let's do some wheelie tests real quick. All right, let's try some more uh, wheelies real quick. Hoss is already set up, so he wanted to go first. Remember, this is on 4S, y'all. This horse will probably ride a wheelie all the way down and back. I'll probably have to take both of these out and do a speed test on a flatter area, but I did want to kind of show this all in the same video. All right, so that's the horse doing its wheelies. All right, next up is going to be the Max. All right, time for the max and will it time with him. The one thing the max has is these lights. I just love the way they look. Okay, it's, it's trying to get it up there. I said the horse is gonna wheel a lot more because it is lighter. And it does have a powerful system in there as well. So now one more time with these wheelies. So it's not riding a wheelie a hundred percent, but at least it's not backflipping when I do the wheelies. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> All right, that's it for wheelie testing. Let's uh, take it off road and do some mild jumps real quick. All right, y'all, first up is going to be the Max. Now, we already know this is going to handle a little bit better off-road than the Haas is because it is the Wide Max. So if it wasn't as, if it didn't have this Wide kit on here, you guys would definitely see a difference. And I actually have plans for this to do something with it really soon, so you guys will see that. I think it'll be pretty cool what you guys like what I'm going to do with this. Max coming up soon. So the wide kit is a definite need for the Traxxas Max. Put off one back flip. I'm not going to make this video too long. Try to do one more real quick on this little area that I know I can hit it better with. There we go. <laughs> Gotta love when your car shows off and it does things right, right? <laughs> All right, we'll do one more. Full blast. All right, and that is the max. Let's go ahead and get the hoss out. And what I'll have to do is uh, get this uh, hoss versus the Stampede 4x4 at some point. Now, my Stampede ain't stock either, so I think I got a VXL system I can possibly throw up in there, but you guys see with this 4S system in here, running 4S light bulb, it's gonna willy a lot more. But it's still handling the power good. It really is. Look at that Willie off road. He's like, ooh.
And I really don't have the TSM turned up on either one of these. If you turn them up, it's gonna it's gonna handle a little bit better if the TSM turned up, but I decided not to do that. So two wheel motion there. Ooh, but but but. I want to bust my body up too bad so we'll probably do like one more maybe two jumps with the hoss and then we'll go ahead and uh, we'll wrap this up see my body's popping up on the side a little bit got another vet over there got a white vet okay we are not going to self ride because i'm not going to tear my body up all right we are back one more jump with the hoss and we will, as I used to say at high school, in summary, to try to make my essay seem longer. <laughs> Woo, hoss jumping good there. He said he wants to do it one more time for y'all, so we'll do it again. Come on through here. And he landed, but he shut off. Let me go ahead and get this turn back on real quick. All right, we're back. He only shut off. Um, I'm using a BLX speed controller 200 from Arma. And it has XT90 connectors on it. And the battery, as you guys saw, have EC5. So there is a difference um, with those two. Let's see if we can back this uh, max up over here real quick. Get these two lined up for a summarization of these. So... There you guys go, quick run of both of these together. I did wanna kinda get them out and run them together so you guys can see that. Price difference, they're about, the Haas is 469 as of the time of this video. The Max is 529, but it does have about 150 plus of upgrades on it. So, it's about a $700 truck that's sitting right here with the lights and the wide Max kit on it. But I haven't done any maintenance to this thing in over a year. I mean, literally, I just replaced the tire, I put the A arms on to make it wider, and that was it. And it does need to be looked over to make sure everything is uh, working properly. But that is a run of both of these. Durability wise, the Max is going to have it up. I mean, it really is. The Max is going to be a lot more durable than the Haas is um, in its original configuration. I haven't did a lot of tests with the um, wider A arms on it, but it's still going to be a lot more durable. I just know just because of the way I drive it, and knowing that certain things may or may not break on. I mean, the drive shafts are eventually going to break on this horse at some point i'll replace those when they do but uh you guys are asking kind of which one should you get because people ask me that it's kind of going to be your discretion on that you guys see that the horse is a lot smaller than the max um it does cost a little bit less and i just changed the speed control now you can get a cheap uh for a speed so if you don't want to go at this one because i am going to run 6s on this soon y'all got to wait till y'all see what i'm going to do this thing yeah, I'll just wait. But uh, <laughs> you can just get a 4S speaker, so it's about 70, 80 bucks, like a Hobby, re a Hobby Wing rebrand or remade one or something like that. Put that in there and be fine with it if you want to do that. So that's possible. Just make sure it does have 6.5 bullet connectors for the motor. So there there it is, guys. I mean, I like both trucks. I like, run, I like running both trucks. Um, and I take both trucks kind of when I go out to just certain areas just to run and bash and something kind of just small to take with me But pretty soon I'll run the hoss against the stampede 4x4 and then I'll probably get all, all the uh, trucks out and just run them off So you guys can see them all run and I'll try to make sure I bring the ramp too next time So anyway guys put your comments down below which one you like more uh, I know it's gonna be give or take you guys the price is what it is um, Traxxas prices or cars like that this is based off of, in my opinion, off of the Stampede 4x4, the Haas is, and it justifies the price for it at being 469 A Stampede's 379 I think it is, and it's got better tires on it, a longer chassis, it can fit better batteries on it, a better body. Um, it's got like a center diff in it. Uh, it's got a steel teeth on the center diff as well. It's got a lot of upgrades, so it does justify it, in my opinion, why they have it priced like that. Industry standard, it probably is a little high compared to everything else that's out there. But I'm going to take this against some other cars as well and just run it on 3S, the Haas that is. So you guys stay tuned for those videos as well. And I'll get a, a different area to run these and I'll try to get these out on a Saturday and run them both so we can try to open them up and see what kind of speeds we get. So anyway, that's enough of my yapping. Put your comments down below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for more videos.